started. Here is the exterior packaging of the Kat Von D Studded Kiss Lipsticks. I got one in Coven. It's like an oven with a C. A Coven. I was pronouncing it Coven before. Any hooser. The interior packaging or the packaging of the actual lipstick itself looks like this. I love this packaging. I've heard so many people say that they don't like it, that it hurts their hand to hold it. Like, right, come on. It's not actual spikes. It's just studded. You know, if you're a stud muffin, like it doesn't hurt. Feels good in the hand. Ew, too far. Okay, no, I didn't mean it like that. Anyways, let's just continue. Scroll you guys in. Since I've been on this black kick lately of like severely black shadow, nail polish colors, accessories. I've been wearing a lot of black clothing. I've just been on a black kick lately. So as you guys can see, the packaging of this is gorgeous. It has her little logo at the top there. I love the packaging. The color is on the bottom, so you know what color of lipstick. The name, the uh, ounces and stuff like that. And then the lipstick itself looks like this. So as you can see, there's also the logo on the lipstick as well, which makes it very sleek. This is the full lipstick you get in there, so that's the entire tube. The scent is straight vanilla. Now this lipstick color is unlike any color that I've personally ever had. I thought, oh, that looks exactly like Delilah by Lime Crime or Nicki Minaj 2 by MAC. But, you know, I like this color, so I will get it because I love the lilac lips. However, when I compared those, it looks nothing like it. I legitimately don't have any color like this in my collection. So I have Delilah here, or Delilah, um, by Lime Crime, because that's what, honestly, in my head, when I very first saw Coven, that's what it reminded me of. So Delilah, it is similar, but you can definitely see a difference right away. So when I brought this home and looked at my collection at Delilah and was like, oh my goodness, it looks nothing like this that's way lighter than this is so maybe airborne unicorn by lime crime it is darker but this is more lilac and this is more like just like a straight purple in my opinion and viva glam nikki 2 doesn't even compare i just thought that in my head just from seeing it but this is way lighter and doesn't even compare to this but i just want to show you just in case anyone else may have thought that these aren't the only purple and lilac lipsticks in the world there are tons so maybe you guys know some dupes as well so definitely leave them in the comments below if you guys find any dupes for this let's go ahead and try this on so here is what it looks like on the lips to me I love the lipstick in the actual tube itself but I am not a fan of what it looks like on me. I have seen what it looks like on some other people and it does not suit most people, but there are some girls who can really pull it off and I think it looks beautiful on them. On me personally, I don't really like it. I'll scroll out so you guys can see it in full effect. So here is what it looks like. So it kind of does match my hair accessory, but to me it's a little bit dramatic and not really in the right way. Um, there are some people that are gonna love it on me, I know, but to me, I do not like it. Maybe if I was doing, and I'm not trying to be disrespectful, like an alien Halloween tutorial, I feel like this would look very good, like aquatic or futuristic or something like that. But just as like an everyday lipstick, I don't see this working for most people. Rock this if you want. I'm just saying that it is some, isn't something that I would like, just color wise. It is a bit drying on the lips, but it does feel like it would stay on most of the day. I love the smell. Not really hard to apply, but like I said, drying. I love the after effect product wise. Like I feel like my lips are smooth. It's not just gonna rub off. I'm just not a fan of the actual color itself. And this one was one of the most popular shades. I think it was just because of the tube. Like it looks amazing in the tube and it's something, like I said, I've never had before. Um, let me know what you guys think though. I love to know what you guys think and what your thoughts are on this specific lipstick and color on me and maybe on you as well if you've tried it. So that was my entire review and first impressions on the Kat Von D studded lipstick in the color coven. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will talk to you guys later. Bye guys. I know you like that. Like that.